Hello. Here comes a small video to demonstrate Gajan's experience in Modbus and BACnet protocol on Raspberry Pi board running Raspberry and Wheezy Linux distribution. We have taken the open source Modbus and BACnet stack and added full-fledged gateway application for Modbus to BACnet in Linux. Recently we have ported the same Modbus to BACnet gateway application on top of Raspberry and Wheezy Linux distribution running on Raspberry Pi. We also have designed and developed web GUI interface for the Modbus to BACnet gateway configurations using PHP and HTML. Let us see how the device configuration for the gateway is done. On the left side of the web GUI, modules are listed. Device administrator has to issue username and password for configuring or updating any modules. We will now log in and create a Modbus channel. Enter Modbus channel IP and port number here and save a configuration. As you can see, created Modbus channels will be listed in the same page. Next module to be configured is the Modbus slave. We will create the Modbus slave now and will save the configuration. Let us move to next module BACnet device object. Options for configuring the right priority. APDU timeout, APDU retires, max APDU, network ID, who is pole frequency are provided here. BBMD support is also provided for this gateway device. Administrator can use BBMD page to do the BBMD configuration. Now we will move to the data point mapping creation page. The BACnet objects and Modbus register shall be mapped manually using Web GUI. This mapping is used by the device software to convert the BACnet queries to Modbus requests. BACnet object types can be mapped to four Modbus register types as input register, holding register, discrete and coil. Following are the BACnet object types supported. Analog input, analog output, analog value, binary input, binary output, binary value, multi-state input, multi-state output, multi-state value, life safety point, life safety zone, large analog value. Modbus input register or holding register can be mapped to binary input or value in a granularity of bits. Input or holding register is 16 bit and each of these 16 bits can be mapped to binary input or binary value object type. Two device specific Modbus register types are also introduced bit packed input register and bit packed holding register. We have also provided support for batch mode data point mapping creation. Batch mode mapping creation is to create a set or batch of data point mappings of same type. Created mappings can be viewed in list mappings page. Update or delete mapping option is in list mappings page. Device management page offers the following features firmware upgrade, restore factory default settings, export database, Restart device and device credential changes. An easy way to create data point mapping from a file supported by CSV mode upload feature and it also supports export for data point mapping creation. Next page is the device status page, in which transmit. Receive and error counts of Modbus and BACnet packets are displayed. This status page is automatically updated in every 5 seconds. We have tested the gateway functionality specific to Modbus and BACnet as well as the web GUI interface using automation framework, robot framework, in an incremental integration and release manner.
You can visit us on www.gadden.com for getting more details on our expertise. Thank you for visiting our video.